So now we've got three members of Lights, Camera, Faction in here with the assistance at ringside. He just tossed Rocky G the chain. I don't know what's going to go on with that. Okay. But look at this. Tuck that away. They are, you want to talk about working together, Chris Bay. Lights, Camera, Faction. They are going three on one on Sepa Patu. Fairness, if that would be a fair fight, the three of them against Sefa. Up, oh, two of them, two of them are gone. Watson, he's still around, but Sefa Fatu isn't playing tonight. Next time. Yeah, well, okay. yeah, with Lazarus gone, Macho, Macho Mouse would be the strongest rodent in this contest. Here comes Watson. Whoa! Oh, look, oh. Look, whoa, whoa. they See, saved him. That's the advantage right there that I'm talking about. Wow. And look at this, they're this holding him up. Oh, EC Dope, EC Dope. No, he's still up. Sefa can't get rid of Watson. Wow. Watson has been eliminated. And Sefa Fatu single-handedly has eliminated Lights Camera Faction. have time limits but not interviews. You, you would hope they did.
and lights Maybe. camera faction on the outside. Why is he sacrificing one of his one of his faction mates? Have you seen these lights camera faction well, contracts? I guess, I guess that's a smart move from Action Braxton getting Fresco started, but look at this. Fresco Maddox. Oh my god, I'm shocked this is happening. I told you, once he got rid of that other uh, sandbagger, uh, he still he actually ain't too bad. Yeah, he ain't too bad, but he ain't Sepapa too, because the tide turned quickly. <laughs> Sepapa too single-handedly eliminated the entire Braxton faction. And against all odds, Sepa came up a little short. One of the final three men in that matchup for the second year in a row. Since it's a handicap match, is it four on one, three on one, or two on one? I still like the odds of Sefa taking on all four and coming out victorious. I feel like that's well, bound to happen. He threw the three of them out against all odds, so. He still just got to beat up Primo. He can use a good beating. I know. And with his beard, that makes five, but look at that. Lights, camera, dumbass. He gets sent to the outside. Fresco, oh no! Fresco tried to save himself, and but his went, body wouldn't allow it. He went crashing down. And I guess Fresco's the designated punching bag of Light's camera faction. It's a good roll for him. And just trying to shave him. Came in the chest of Fresco, who somehow, a little bit of a comeback. Each time he goes after Sefa too, it just wakes him up and angers him. And there's the Uranagi right on the edge of the ring. Mostly wood and steel the back of Fresco collided into, courtesy of Sefa Fatu, but here's... Oh, look at that, Braxton. Did something good. And look at that, now he wants to tag. Makes sense, two on one. Uh, I, I, advantage at the moment for Lights Camera Faction. When the hell did someone have to like spin the camera film to record anything? What year is it? Well, it's a very rare occasion that uh, Braxton's in control of something. And that's anything, not just when he's in the ring. Oh, and once again, Sefa Fatu gets caught. I don't know if Sefa's a little cocky in this matchup. And that, right there, could be a game changer for this matchup. Well, that, that shows a, you how that, it, yeah. That one count was uh, the greatest moment of Braxton's career. And that was a knee strike, but doesn't send Sefa down. Follow-up does. And that's two big knees. And that's a two count. That elbow has been targeted, that arm. That is the shooting location on Sefa Fatu for Lights Camera Faction. And right now, Sefa in big trouble. Maybe he bit off a little more than he could chew taking on two guys. Memphis on him. Braxton has the referee distracted on the other side. And they're just working on the left arm of Sefa Fatu. I'm pretty sure that wouldn't have been illegal considering it's a handicap match, to be honest with you. You know, for those who do not know, Sefa, former Nevada State champion, brother of the Uso, son of Rikishi, WWE Hall of Famer. Yeah, we've seen his father support him in the past. 
and his crowning achievement in FSW, the Nike One, the Nevada State title from current FSW heavyweight champion Graves. Last January, no escape. Sefa firing with the right hand. Sefa is a resilient competitor. Oh no. And Sefa. Fresco doesn't even know. Well, Sefa Fatu knows all about this. Very Memphis style wrestling there. JR Smooth will be proud. Little miscommunication going on. Sefafa too, now in control of this matchup again. And that was a hell of a Samoan drop. And another. I don't know what Lights Camera Faction thought they were gonna accomplish in this match. Sefafa too. Chains of Umaga snapping the neck. A fresco matic with that running hip attack. One, two, three. Oh, and Isaac Hayes yanked out of the ring. Poor chef. Yeah, this will work. And another miscue by the L LCF. And the super kick connects. One, two, three. Oh no, Watson! Well, the beating continues. All three members of Lights Camera Faction and Primo. Sefa Fatu scores the pinfall, but it, he is getting the brunt of the punishment. They may have lost the battle, but they feel like they're winning the war. What the hell am I seeing here? Light camera faction standing tall, or so we thought. More like lights. Yeah, Braxton. Lights, camera. Oh, yeah. This is what we all expected to happen from the start. It just took a little longer than we planned on. And Sefa was going up top. We need to get Braxton a body double. I don't think he can handle this. I mean, Sefa Fatu wins the matchup. I feel like he should be looking for bigger things than Lights Camera Faction. These guys are annoying, I get that, but Sefa Fatu is one of the top competitors in FSW. Sefa might have to make a call to the rest of the Samoan dynasty.